And we're back. Let's see, anything good? Thank you. And just let me check here. Yeah, that's worth it. So that did some pretty good damage, actually. Okay. Snow tunic. I'll take that. He really did it. Tear really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? I'm gonna have to say the latter. I'm here for you. Really need Ready more upgrades for these weapons. Brrr, whatever. What else we got? Rage burst, huh? Yeah, let's do it. May it strike true. Oh, it's an attachment. Okay. All right. Anything else before we go? Mm, never mind. Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. Can't forget my head. Literally not attached to my body. if I take a little peek at you? I promise I'll be brief. Is that a squirrel? My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? Well, this must be the squirrel that tames the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squid ink. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait, if you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter, would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... <clears throat> now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. <clears throat> Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, you'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. So that's why good Master Brock needed an alpine seed. Clearly you have important matters afoot. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places, a realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky.
Since I only have one seed, I might as well use it for the actual main quest. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the Land of the Elves. Sure I can. Alfron was the first time we ever roam traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on us. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of dark elves to get to the light. You interfered in the elf war. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. The dark elves were covering it with their sticky hide stuff. When we freed it, the light elves came back. They seem better now. <laughs> Did they now? This Alfine. game is just full of interesting characters. It's been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Broken history. Swirl. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. This isn't, a, isn't exactly a game that I would have expected. I that, see to be the honest. elves continue their war. Yeah, so much for things being better in Alpha. <laughs> Yikes. Thimble Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Thimble Winter. A living desert. Huh. Where have I heard that before? Hold on. I hear something out there. Something vague. It's in pain. Ooh, a box. What do you hear? Feels like some kind of animal. How could anything live in a storm like that? Plenty of caves under the desert. Not exactly a paragon of comfort, but the dark elves get on best they can. How do I destroy that thing? Go! Or, I guess, what am I supposed to do with it? Uh... No, that's... Her. What the heck? Okay, so that should burn too, right? I just can't reach it. I don't see anywhere else I can climb. And that's about the only angle I can get. Maybe it's another up. There, the Temple of Light. Groa's shrine go. is at the top. So where's the last one? Bingo! Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting no one your chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. I'm kind of a loot whore. Ah, very well. Oh, oh, I appreciate the information. I'll go ahead and check it out a little bit later.
Freyr never bothered returning to Alfheim, did he, Mimir? Aye, no. I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freya's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. <laughs> one written down. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight Stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, growing like moss on a fallen tree. Oh! I didn't know it could do that. We're doing trick shots now. Sova! The wee bastards about to explode! Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freyr of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. You hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. We do not have a choice. Where did one read the light? Atreus, focus! They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly no other way? Not like they're giving us much of a choice. So your father said. I'm just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. Like somebody else we know. To Freyr, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, Freyr's. While knowing the elves, there are probably <laughs> more tributes to find. <laughs> Doesn't look like I can break it. things I have to come back for later. It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. Didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father, now you go. Unfortunately for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Hmm. Yeah, I would be a little upset, the too. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah, it's here. You keep pushing forward.
Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? Look at the big brain on you. What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between Light and Dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the Light. Solid okay. Light. Guess some things don't change. Above the door, there's a light crystal. Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. It's the light! Ah. Ow. I've never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye. Fimple winter, you reckon? Of course, making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the Elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power, and thus, the Light Elves were born. The lore in this game is uh, pretty easy, to, easy enough to follow, but like I said, I definitely need to brush up on my mythology, I guess. Where does this need to bounce off of? I don't think it has anything to do with this, even though it is purple. Uh, Our light elf friends will be less than pleased. Speaking of light elves, let me try talking to them again. They may just to let these two do their thing, brother. On your left! Not in a talking mood. Poor souls. Here, they came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. I have an idea to get us across. <laughs> Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way, the shrine awaits. Brilliant. <laughs> The temple looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use Alpine's light to enhance the temple, and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. The shrine is this way, Kratos. Yeah, who knows? Just like to be thorough. I see. By all means. 
They smell awful. Great sight! Suicide bombers. Gold chest, let's go. Anything interesting this way? Huh. Glad we explored. I knew there were bombs in this game. Everything else gets blown up. to get rid of those things. That worked out way better than I expected. All right, moving on. Shall we continue? So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye. The Light Elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. There's more Twilight Stone up there. I am fully more aware. More inspiring lyricism from the mind of Gvasia. Light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. <gasps> Dude's like, I'll take care of it with words. Oh, there, friends. Here Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here. Get back. Watch your leg. <laughs> <laughs> Don't blame me, I'm just trashing the combat. We get there eventually. Maybe you can throw those back at him! Get a boy. At least I tried. I get it now. Why they keep fighting? The Dark Elves want the souls and the light left alone. But the Light Elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Aye. So then, which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. And not our place to say. This is an Elven conflict. I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. Yes, yes, we know you were right. They sure made a lot of these light doors. Hmm. Fortifications. Aye, none too eager to let the Dark Elves run the roost again. Damn it! Oh 
Oh, yeah, I forgot oh. to do that. Above you, father! Shoot it down! What became of Kabasir? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of his audience. Well, Thor. Just say that then. I suppose I'll leave you to it. Imagine having the Blades of Chaos with you. I mean, especially in the cities these days. Be swinging around like Spider-Man almost, you know what I mean? Speaking of which... What the hell am I supposed to do here? Ah. <laughs> Wait, how do I get the chest? There's twilight stone on the ground. No. There we go. I wonder if we could use twilight stone against them. Come on, use your brain. I think I saw it. Oh, it's below me. I made that way harder on myself than I had Masterfully to. done. The light door blocking the chest is gone. Now we just need to find a way over there. You guys don't have to mock me. But I told you guys, eventually I will get it done. I'm just a little slow. This is why I usually have the boy That's the me. wrong. Oh, I see. Another chest. He's getting the hang yes, of it. Yes, another chest. I've never seen the light elves with so much control over the temple. Yes, that's on us. They must have anointed a new temple guardian. Spartoli offers counterpart. We can continue up this way. Did Homeboy just pull a Superman? Here they come. Do what you must. We still can't 
figure out how they're making light bridges. Look at this statue. These crystals. I've noticed them on the elves as well. Yes, yes, that's fascinating, but how does that help I us? wonder, if this statue were to fall over the chasm... Get that one out of my own. I didn't need that. Once again, destroying shit oh, saves today. The crystals still make light bridges. Now the light elves wear them. Smart. Almost there. Allow me. Oh. I dare say he's beginning to enjoy the vandalism. Pretty soon, he'll be laying waste to pottery. Shall we continue? Sounds like Link. Could you imagine if Link was actually the, the size of this guy? Another chest. on these frustrating trials. You would know better than us, brother. I can't remember the last time I visited the Norns. Nor do I okay, that's two of them. Where is the third? Ooh, box. Probably uh, pretty used to it, there. That, right? Yeah, yeah, I saw it. I need the last one, though. Where's the last one at? There it is. Okay. Alright. Should... I'd probably start with this one, right? Get the harder ones out of the way, because I can't aim. Bingo! Well done. It's an apple! I'll take it. And here we go again. Another light door. There's some twilight stone on that statue shield. But that angle is. Do you think they're 
think there's any way to stop the elves from fighting each other? We've had prayers all abandoned for the home a lasting peace may have formed, but now... Can we really place all the blame on Freya? This war started long before his arrival. But he had the power to heal this land and end the war, did he not? He made his choice. The wrong one. For Alfheim, perhaps. But not necessarily for him. Well, I suppose we're all entitled to walk our own path, regardless of where they end. Be off! Everyone in this game is just bitter about something. <laughs> Okay, so I moved it. be a way to move this statue's twilight stone to get the right angle. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. The statue keeps getting stuck on the wing. Okay. Oh. I tried hitting that before. Sure hope so. Here, the last time we were here. Oh, you did from the outside. Killed the Dark okay. Elf King. That's unfortunate. I'd wondered what became of Spark. We had to defend ourselves, but when he died, he told us we helped the wrong side. I see. Oh, Fine job, no obsessive complaining that we this did way. pick the wrong side. We're almost there. <laughs> Do you still hear something wounded out there? I think so. It could mm -hmm. just be the storm. Perhaps we can investigate, once we've uncovered a mysterious seer's hidden prophecy. Not much to see down there. A lot of fog. There, the central chamber will bring us to the top. Once we find our way past yet another light door. What? Power? Growth? Ambition? A bit vague, you know. Much like your explanations, buddy. Allow me to speed this up. 
Or would you? Thank you. The angle should work, Kratos. Well done. At your service. Oh, five foul time. How stunning. Nothing. What's wrong? I could hear Mother inside last time. But I can't anymore. Her soul is one with the light now. United by forces older than Odin himself. She is at peace, Atreus. I hope so. When Father went inside the light, he said You went he... inside the light of Alfheim? Yes. And yet here you stand, of sound mind and decidedly not incinerated. You must tell me, Kratos, what did you see? That memory is for me alone. But I felt only moments pass. Didn't feel like moments to me. I was trapped. Atreus overcame great odds to save me. One could but only imagine. Well then, Groa's triptych awaits. So, did you ever meet Groa? Many times. But she was plagued by constant visions, so... Conversation was... Difficult, to say the least. Father, she's... she's gone. Yes. Keep moving. We're almost there. Huh. They've changed some stuff. Last time, there was all this Hive stuff up here. So many Dark Elves. I... All this time, I thought the Dark Elf King... I thought all the Dark Elves were... Tear? Yes? Did we help the wrong side? Hmm. Are you certain that's the right question? I... What's the right question? Is there a right side? Exactly. What do you think, Atreus? Is there a right side in this war? I don't know. Then perhaps you shouldn't pick one. The philosophy in this game is interesting. The way that you look at things from a different perspective. But what really is getting my interest is the visuals in their face, you can actually see the emotions, which is crazy. And I mean, playing the first couple of them, and, and granted I didn't play the last one, it, I don't know, I guess I'm surprised to see this much attention to detail in their emotions. I really do like it though. getting sidetracked. <laughs> 